23rd of August 1944, we previously heard about Witold Kirchen, codenamed Raider. And on this day, Kirchen on his own decided to go through a gateway. And as he went through the gateway, he walked into a room. And in the room were 14 German soldiers sitting around a table filled with guns and ammunition. He tries to shoot them. Click. His gun doesn't fire. He tries to shoot again. It doesn't fire. So he does the only thing he can think of. He just runs in there shouting, hands up, hands up, everybody surrender. And to his surprise, and to their surprise, the German soldiers decide to do exactly that. And he bundles them out, captures the weapons, and takes them back to his own unit. The Poles weren't always so unlucky as attacking as at the Gdansk railway station. On the 23rd of August, they attacked the Holy Cross Church behind me, which holds Chopin's heart. And this building, which was a German uh, gendarmerie police station. As a result, they captured dozens of German police officers and freed 20 Polish policemen who'd been holed up in there as prisoners. Thanks for watching this episode of 63 Days of Extraordinary Courage. Every day we tell the story of the Warsaw Rising. Please share this film and your opinion using the hashtag 63 Days. And don't forget to tune in to tomorrow's episode at 5 p.m. Warsaw time, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time.